hundreds of paintings stolen by the Nazis have been found. Nearly one billion dollars worth of art. The largest recovery of looted art in history. The discovery of some 1,400 works of art at an apartment in Munich is a stunning piece of news for so many people that aren't familiar with the full extent of the Nazi looting during World War II. A major motion picture is coming out in a few months about the massive effort to find all the fine art that the Nazis stole. I'm gonna get in the war. Monuments, man. Signed by Roosevelt. I want to see that. We have been tasked to find and protect buildings, monuments, and art. The French are hiding it, the Germans are finding it, and taking it. The United States and Great Britain set the gold standard for the protection of cultural treasures during a world war that cost the lives of 65 million people. What is all this? People's lives. Six million pieces were stolen. It's the biggest treasure hunt. It's certainly the biggest art heist ever. Works from Henri Matisse, Pablo Picasso. Previously unknown piece by Marc Chagall. The discovery in Munich underscores the importance of what the Monuments Men did during World War II. It's called the Nero Decree. It is written by Hitler, signed by Hitler. It says if he dies or if Germany falls, they're to destroy everything. One of the key objectives of the Monuments Men film with George Clooney is for people to be able to see these announcements like the one in Munich in that context. Hitler's ambition to collect art and use it as a weapon of propaganda, the role of the Monuments Men and Women to try and preserve works of art and cultural treasures, their role as art detectives in finding and returning some of these works of art. Still there. Want to go get it? Also the fact that their job wasn't finished and many things are still out there today. Might we get to a stage where our search for missing works of art taken by the Nazis or others ends? Yes, that will diminish. But the mission of the Monuments Men really will never end. If you destroy an entire generation of people's culture, it's as if they never existed. That's what Hitler wants. He really wanted it all. This is about stealing your culture. If you take their culture away, then you have nothing. You can kill people and they'll come back, but you can't take their culture away. Their history. Mm -hmm. To the monuments, man.